Proof sure does get found quickly when people are telling the truth. Here's the ID number from the first kid, the second kid, and now the third kid. So we got three kids under the age of 18 who all have been having conversations with the same person on Discord with the same ID number. The same ID number and person saying that they'll do a duet, and three days later, Clap Daddy does the duet. The same account that answers to the name Colton and keeps calling children handsome. The same account that likes to send pictures from below the waist to children that are underage. And have tons of phone calls with. Tons. Tons with children and again give me a second cutie and again answers to the name colton and this is the 17 year old kid they were talking to a very clear pattern of behavior with children hearing those things that ava said about me really shocking and it really hurts i've done nothing but love and support everyone i've done nothing but help people yes I have friends who are trans who are younger, but I've also have friends who are trans who are older and because I support the trans community. I've done nothing but uplift people and help people and it hurts to hear these things that Ava said. I'm not going to go bash on Ava, I'm not going to go tell people to go whatever with her. This is probably why Every day, I just slowly start not wanting to do TikTok anymore. And this is probably why I'm going to quit TikTok soon. Because of this toxi toxicity and lies being spread. And I just want to let you guys know that. Here With everything being said, I would like to make an apology to anyone who I've made feel uncomfortable. Or made them feel like I was being malicious towards them. I am sorry. That was never my intention. I wanted nothing but the best for you guys. Um, and if you can come and talk to me personally, so we can have a civil discussion on what I did wrong, thank you.